the working film side for 10 whole years before we picked it up and we moved it over here piece by individual piece for your enjoyment on the tour today. Now looking around you'll see the lights are low, the tables are dressed and those fires are burning. And this is what we call in the film industry a hot set. What does that mean? Well it means it's ready for filming and as a result it's going to look amazing on your cameras. So that's your cue. If you've not done so already, get those cameras out, get those phones out, start snapping away, and I'm going to meet you by the fireplace to reveal more hidden secrets about this incredible set. Keep coming all the way over there, ladies and gents, at the back so we can get that cinema screen down. We can actually, believe it or not, fit 400, yes, 400 cast and crew into this room. Uh, that's the equivalent of 22 double-decker buses, so we've definitely got room for all of your happy, smiling, excited faces here this morning. Fantastic. So as you come in and doors close, you start to have a little look around. I'm sure a lot of you are starting to notice there's an amazing attention to detail that you perhaps didn't realise when you were first watching these films. You have a look at the front and the back walls, you will see that you have some murals up there. Uh, now these are actually hand-painted by the scenic artist for the very first film, The Philosopher's Stone, 15 years ago. And they were then left to age under the studio lights. So at some point in the near future, they may well disappear completely. But whilst we are talking about details, there is one rather large, rather important detail that is definitely missing from this room. And if we cast our eyes upwards, you will see that we have no ceiling. Oh no! Uh, now you all remember that the Great Hill ceiling was enchanted. Sadly, I hate to break it to you, but enchanted ceilings, they're really tricky to come by in our days. So rather than try and get sun, moon, stars up there, all of that was added in post-production with computer effects. But whilst the ceiling isn't real, the floor you're standing on, that definitely is. If you'd like to join me and have a good old stamp on the floor, you can pop, skip, jump, tap, out, anything you like. Uh, because this is actually real, your flagstone. Now, this can actually be found in real castles up and down the UK, and it is very rare that any film set would have anything like this. But our film we're going to do early on, sets like this one, would have to endure a lot of wear and tear. 